Do you want to turn off your lights when everyone leaves the house? Stay tuned. Hello people and welcome to another episode of Everyday Smart. Today we're going to be showing how you can control your devices based on presence so that when someone leaves your house you can have some automations be executed. For this we're going to be using the Hubitat Elevation Hub, in my case it's the C5 model Additionally, you're going to be needing a presence device, which in my case, I'm going to be using a phone. And we're also going to be using some smart switches. In your case, you can use whichever smart device you want to use for these automations. But again, in my case, it's going to be the smart switches. So let's get to it. First thing we need to do is to go to the apps section. And then go into rule machine. Click on create new rule. Name this rule, in my case, I'm going to call it Presence Automations. Click on Select Trigger Events. Now, like I already mentioned, you want this automation to run when someone leaves. So the trigger for this rule is going to be Presence. So click on the Event Trigger and select Presence. Now click on present sensors to select your different sensors. Now in my case, I want to make sure that this automation runs only when everyone leaves and not only one person. So I want to select multiple present devices. In my case, it's going to be two, but in your case, it could be as many as you have. So I'm going to select my two, the ES phone and the GALS phone. Click update. And then like I already mentioned is when everyone leaves so for presence i want to select leaves that's it click on done with this trigger event and that's the only trigger event that we need for this rule so click on done with trigger events now let's go to select the actions to run so click on select actions to run click on select action type to add now like i already mentioned as well i want to run this rule only when everyone leaves so in order to do this, we have to create a conditional action to verify that indeed everyone have left the house. So click on conditional action, click on select which action, click if conditions then. Click on define condition and we're going to be needing a new condition for this. So click new condition. Click on action condition and again, this is going to be based on presence. So look for presence. Click on presence sensors to select your presence devices. Select the same ones you selected previously. So in my case, it was the ES phone and the GALS phone. Click update. Now, so far, this is set up for any of them. But again, I want to make sure that it is when everyone leaves. So enable this toggle to make sure that it is for all of these and not just one of those. And for the present state, I want when everyone is not present. So select that. That's all we have to select. So click on done with this condition. Click done with conditional action. That's the only condition we want. So now we can go ahead and add our real action. So click on select action type to add. Click on control switches, in my case, because it's going to be turning off switches in your case is whatever it is applicable for you. Click on select which action and I'm going to select turn switches off. Click on turn switches off to select my devices. Now for the sake of this tutorial, I'm going to select just this group that I created for my first floor and not every single switch. For your case, you can select every single switch or you can have a group for your entire house, however you want it. So select your device, click update. 
Now, if you want to add a delay for this execution, you can click here and add your delay for seconds or minutes. In my case, I want it to be executed right away, so I'm not gonna select that. Click done with this action. So that's the only action I want to execute, but it is always good to close the conditional action. So click on select action type to add, click on conditional action, click on select which action and select end if. Click on done with this action. And these are all the actions we need for this rule. So click on done with actions. And there you have it. So a quick summary of what we have here. Every time that someone, anyone leaves the house, this rule is gonna be triggered. Now, when the rule is triggered, this conditional action here is gonna verify that everyone is not present. If that is true, then it's gonna turn off my first floor lights. If only one person leaves and there are other people present, then this rule is gonna remain false. Therefore, this is not gonna be executed so if there were lights on, they will remain on. They will turn off only when everyone leaves. And then again, to close the conditional action, this end if. That's it for the creation of the rule. Click done so it can be fully created and saved on your device. And this is it. This is a pretty simple automation. Again, you can modify it to suit your needs. I hope you liked this video. If you liked it, please the like button. Also subscribe to my channel. It's gonna help me tremendously. And you don't want to miss any of my future videos. So click the bell icon so you get notified every time I upload a new video. Thank you for watching and see you next time.